Hey guys, so I am standing out in my garage getting ready to film this video for you about how we are going to organize our new car for our first ever road trip in it. We have a Pacifica Chrysler, a Chrysler Pacifica 2017 minivan. Yep, I caved and got a minivan. Um, I was already a soccer mom before because my daughter plays soccer. But I want to show you some how we're going to organize it, things we're going to use in it that we have around our house. And hopefully it will make it a stress-free, as stress-free as possible trip as we can get. Um, I'm not going to show you how we are packing it up. Um, I will be doing videos. There will be videos going up about how I'm packing for me, my kids. Um, how we're packing snacks and that kind of stuff. They will go up after we get back. Uh, I want to get this one up before we leave, so I'm filming it on my iPhone so I can get it edited and uploaded really quick today for you guys so you can see how we're organizing this car and hopefully have some ideas maybe for your end of the summer road trip because back to school time is upon us. It's getting there. So I'm going to go ahead and turn the camera around. And I am going to show you guys the inside of my car, what it looks like. There's one thing in the car that's not going to be there. It's a Christmas present for my daughter and I need to sneak it downstairs. So I will do that shortly. But I'm going to go ahead and flip you guys around and let you see the inside of the car. Okay, so I'm really close to my car. But I mean, it's this is what it is. And I have the doors open because I've been cleaning it out. So I want to, we're going to go from front to back real quick. So when you open the driver's side door, you have this, these little storage compartments. You have one here. This is a handle actually to shut the door. And then you have one down there and that one's for an extra cup. But we sometimes put tissues in there. Um, and I always have a pack of wet wipes. These come from the Dollar Tree. They're great. You get 40 of them for a dollar. They're a little thinner than the traditional ones, but it's just a wet wipe, so it works. Then right here, this came with the car. This is a place to put an umbrella. So I always have an umbrella sitting right there. It's perfect for that. So we climb on in. There's not a ton of storage. Like we have a glove compartment right there. We have little containers here. Um, this is actually a shower caddy from Clever Container. Um, we do have a USB port down there and a cigarette like regular 12 volt DC adapter right there we have a USB and an auxiliary right there but this is a clever container shower caddy this is where me and my husband are gonna put some of our snacks that we want to eat um, it'll keep them from rolling around it'll keep them right at our view like our hand we can get in there it has little side pockets um, for us to put some snacks like granola bars and stuff in back here and then we have back pockets here so we could just like spin it around if we wanted to and then this is going to be hard to open but I won't really need to open it much when we have the snacks in here but this is just a storage compartment there's change in here I always keep an extra travel um, sack in here in case for some reason we go into a grocery store or something and we just need a sack and we don't want to bring one, like have a plastic sack. There is a car charger. There's an extra iPhone cord for me and a car charger and my husband's sunglasses and a big change purse. And there's some restaurant coupons in here. So if we stop at like a Burger King or something. So now to our little console, we have four cup holders in here. This is why I'm saying I don't always put an extra bottle in this section. I usually put my tissues over there. Because we have four cups holders here, um, we put what we're drinking in here and then maybe something that we want later in the back, but that's how it is. And then there's this empty space right here and I have this awesome trash can. It's a collapsible trash can. It also has like a strap, which we put on the armrest. So it keeps it from rolling anywhere and the kids can reach it, we can reach it, and we always keep a bag in it because it's a great trash can. 
so oh and up here I have a 31 um, visor organizer so I can put stuff in here if you know need be for the trip and like a pen and um, cash sometimes if we're doing toll roads or itinerary if we want to have it access or like a little map or something is here um, this is a mirror where I can see the kids it's you know it folds up and then this compartment is for sunglasses so kind of giving you an overview of the car too and we have a thing to hold whoever's phone we might be using GPS on right there so now I'm going to the passenger side is pretty much the same um, thing it's the same stuff on either side so now I'm going to show you my daughter's side of the car this is a clever container organizer for the back seat it holds tissues for her the round tissues and then she can put an extra bottle of water or something over here but she usually puts like her dia her tablet's too big it could fit in here but you know headphones ds and that kind of stuff goes in here once the trip starts and the backpacks usually get zipped up and everything this is her 31 little I'm not sure what these caddies are called but this is going to be where their snacks are going to go that they're going to munch on and have access to that's going to hang right here and then as you can see my son has a all black one she has the gray and pink because it's pink so she has that um so that's basically the organization for back here and there's more room so she can put backpacks and stuff so I'm gonna spin around real quick to the other side. My son is a little bit different. This is an organizer that he has previously tore up, but it's bigger, so it's gonna pull his um, his 3DS. Um, his his tablet can go in the front pocket. Actually, I'm gonna put his tissues in here because these are smaller pockets. Um, but his 3DS can go in this pocket, his 2DS can go here, he can put his tablet in the top, um, headphones can go in here. He tears these things up so much when he has one of his meltdowns with his autism. But this is from High Road, and he didn't totally tear it up, it just kind of came undone. So, I'm still looking for really good ones. I don't really like that clever container one, but it's what we have. Um, and here's his seat that's not supposed to be like that and then he has one just the same for him and yes we have automatic closing doors on this thing which is great so here's the back of the car like i said that's the gift i always have my big umbrella we have stow and go seating so the seats are in here so when we pop this one up if we need to there's a big deep compartment here we can store stuff in but the only organization back here is over here on this side this is a 31 it's like a makeup bag but i use it as our first aid kit very specific for our family we have multi-purpose wipes for the car which i probably should get more of those we have a roll of paper towels i could probably sit this up there let's try that um and this is our just in case kit jumper cables anything that we're going to need if we have car trouble is in this kit and it does have a first aid kit in there, but I don't want to open it. So we always pack have our own. I'm gonna try. It'll probably be easier if I did this too two handed, but I don't have two hands right now. Oh yeah, this is good. There we go. That's in there. That's the only storage we really have built into the car in the back of it. It's hot. <laughs> Sorry about that. And then this is a little 31 tote that I'm using in the back. We usually have a, a trunk organizer, but this is smaller and will work better for the trip. We have my husband's neck pillow that he has to have. This is an extra little drawstring bag that folds up nicely. Um, and we have another shopping bag. They're supposed, I have some plastic Walmart sacks in here, um, just in case you need them. And on the other side is going to be some, these are batteries. I think these work in our remotes for our car. 
which own actually, but there's going to be some trash bags um, in one of these pockets on the side. And I do keep these extra cups in here for my kids in case one cup breaks or something. We have all that. But that is basically what is in the car. And that's an extra backseat organizer um, that we use for Memphis. We're going to try that bigger one to hold more of his stuff than the little one. But we're going to keep it in there just on the back of the seat in case we have incidences. But one of those we bought ripped. I spent $20 on those from Amazon. And one of them that we bought, it totally ripped. So it's not a very good quality of one I don't think it is I wish 31 would make them again because I would totally buy one so, so I'm gonna go ahead and shut our doors in our car you can hear the beeping that's our doors shutting so that was the organization that we're gonna use for our trip and this car we don't have a crazy lot amount because well we're not using the car topper so I can reach the kids you know bags to get out an extra outfit if need be or whatever we always pack extra outfits and we're going to a place that has laundry facilities so we can wash things when we get there so I don't want to have it too crazy um, we can't really put stuff under the seat because there's mechanisms and things under there so yeah but that's all the organization that I've got in my car. I'm going to shut my other door so the battery doesn't run down. And yeah, if you guys have any questions about how to organize a minivan, um, I do have some car organizing videos when we had a Journey, which is a smaller SUV. Um, and I will do a video um, after... There's something on my screen. I will do a video when we come back from the trip, how well this organization worked. Um, did it work well? Is it something I'm gonna use again? Blah, blah, blah. But if you guys know of any great backseat organizers for kids, um, for your car, it doesn't have to have like a screen to put a tablet in or anything like that. It just needs to have organization to put them in and store headphones and stuff so we can zip up the backpacks and keep clutter off the floor. So if you have any suggestions, please comment down below for me. Um, we still have a little bit before we leave on our trip. So Amazon two-day prime shipping. If there's great recommendations, I may purchase them and let you know how they go. But like I said, if anyone from 31 Company is watching, please, please, please come back out with the car organizational things and stuff. I loved them when you had them. But I or had some when they were babies and they worked great. But now we don't want anything that needs all those compartments. So yeah, mm -hmm. if you're out there 31 company lit and you bring them back, please let me know. Hope you guys have a great day. Thanks for watching the Red, White, and Blue Home. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and please subscribe if you have not for more content. And like I said, if you guys who follow me would love a Red, White, and Blue Home Facebook group, I will create one and you guys can keep up to date. And if you like, um, want to see pictures from the trip or something, you can follow me on Instagram at phoenixlife23. I hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you later.